Uh, is it low? Is it moderate? Is it high? It is, what do you think? Low, yeah. How low can you go? And hey, we'll take a look at the rain chances tonight coming up in a few minutes. Thanks, Ron. Gina Downs is back with us. She's the vice president of Senior Connection, and it's time to talk about annual enrollment. <laughs> First of all, what does that mean? Well, it's the time of year for everybody who's on Medicare, not those who are still working and are Medicare eligible, but for those who are actually on Medicare, they can review their Medicare Advantage plan or their prescription drug plan at this time of year. It's like our tax season. We have 55 million Americans on Medicare, and the government gives us eight weeks to make changes if you want to. And why is that? Why is there just a limited I, annual enrollment? Honestly, enrollment? I don't know. I think it's for consistency to keep the plans, but unfortunately, the plans make changes throughout the year. What drugs they're covering, what doctors they're covering, they can that's completely fluid throughout so the year. So they can do that anytime. They can do it anytime, okay. but the client or the beneficiary, they can't unless they have a major life event, they're stuck in the plan for a year at a time. So it's a really unfair contractual obligation. The plans tell the government Here's what we're going to offer. Here's the benefits, you know, blah, blah, blah. And government signs off on it. And that's when the purchase, you know, happens from the client. They say, okay, I want this plan because it's covering my medications. It's covering my doctors. Plan starts. Three months later, they make a change. And you can't do anything about it. Are you given any warning? They give you 30 days. They <laughs> <laughs> that's so helpful. It is. That's that is super so helpful. helpful. Yeah, so it's very important to review your coverage every year. Now, those are drastic circumstances that they make those the, those big changes, but it does happen, and it's always a good idea to review it. Even if you're going to stay where you're at, just know what's happening. Just understand it. Um, there are some big changes with one particular drug company this year. They have a premium that's in the mid-20s, and they are going to over $50 a month. It's an over 100% increase in premium for their plan. And a lot of people just haven't even realized it yet because they threw all the documents away. They sent the documents in and then they just threw it away. They didn't read it. And now they're calling, freaking out because they have a more than 100% increase in premium. So, do, so you're telling me we need to hang on to those documents? You need to hang on to them and read them. Ring them read them carefully until you understand it. So besides that other change, what, what, do we, I, what questions do you even need to ask? I mean, that's is, the, uh, where we start. Is my doctor covered? Can I go to the skilled facility I want to? With Medicare Advantage, a lot of people don't realize that skilled care can cause hangups because we're invincible. We're not going to go, right. we're not going to the hospital. We're not going to a skilled facility. So we don't need skilled care. But if you go for a hip replacement and now you need skilled care, you might not be able to go to the facility you want to go to because they're not accepted by your plan. So you need to understand where is it accepted? Where is that coverage available? And you'll see plans advertised for zero dollars, zero dollar copayment, zero dollar premium, zero dollar drugs. There's no free insurance. <laughs> They're going to get their money somewhere. You either are going to have limited coverage or you're going to pay for it somewhere else. So now, just be wary. If it's too good to be true, it is. It usually is. It is. How, it many, is. how many plans are there? There are 28 different drug plans. This year in 2019, there were 26. Now we have 28 for 2020, and there are um, six, 16 Medicare Advantage plans. My goodness. I think. And they're all different. Every one of them's different. They cover drugs differently. They cover doc doctors differently. They have different networks. Uh, it's always exciting. What, has the enrollment actually started? Today, today is, is the, the day. day. Today well, there's perfect the timing to be here. Yes, today so you've got is just 30 the days day. to get December this. 7th. December so 7th. So that's eight weeks. Okay. Yes, it is eight weeks. Until December 7th, you will have that. Um, to add another layer of difficulty or challenge, the Medicare website has just had major changes to it. And it how you have to look at the plans is different. The way it portrays the information is challenging. Um, if you use insulin or inhalers, creams or eye drops, it does not accurately give you those totals right away. You have to adjust it. For example, someone might need one box of five pins of their insulin, but the way it pulls the information, it fills it 75 times in one month. So it gives them 75 boxes of five pins and their, their cost is hundreds of thousands of dollars. So, oh, my goodness. That's why we need you, Gina. Oh, my gosh. Give, the, give Gina <laughs> a call so and send your connection and, and get it right the, the first time or the second time. It, pray. Pray. <laughs> pray. Thanks, Gina. <laughs> we'll be back with more Local Lifestyles right after this. This portion of Lifestyles is sponsored by Senior Connection.